afternoon guys and um, we'll, we'll try some Final Fantasy I haven't done it for a few days continue Clive's story we've got Clive's story because it's the main character you play as you don't play as really any of the others but we'll see, see how the rest of it goes let's remember where we were maybe that's where we were Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm wishful thinking getting 250 subs. Well, you never know. Nice. I'm kind of being quite static with the old sub runes. Well, I'm not too fast at the end of the day. This is, I think this is where we were, like so. I've done one or two of these side, side quests. Side quests do not take up, take up too much, which is quite good. So we've been up here, around there. In the shop. That's where we came in from. A lot of the areas do sort of join up. That's this is where we're actually heading obviously. There's a wee side quest that we're going to probably do it as well. And that's probably a good idea. Said the blight, it's spread even further south. Pushing yet more monsters down with it. I dare say we'll be seeing a few along the way. Then we shall have to keep our wits about us. And these are you pushing just there. Uh, I only have any team one so Sort of tortoise thief, do dirty guys. You can actually from from them, pass them, collect them. And I think if I want to fight them, you can. They're usually no two. Some, some you can just walk past and then just get collectibles or whatever. The good games. Over here. Get him. Sick of Toggle. There, yeah, boy. Sick of Toggle. Get him. Get him, boy. It's nice to pick up. There is a. There's a planet. There. <laughs> Sick of Toggle. You know what to do, boy. Yeah, it builds up a wee bit of XP, you know what I mean? There's plants in here, obviously, we have to work for it, not, not just animals. Usually, relatively obvious. We're in this way. There's a wee area here that seems to be. Sick of Toggle! Don't let them get away! Get him, boy! There, boy! Sick of Toggle! Over here! It is a, getting closer to others, <laughs> it just attracts them. Right? We need to 
som... Det er... Ja... Chester som... Så... Description... Crazy old event, but... Chest... Right. It's even like... There's enemy be in there... To find something... Right, so we're going this way... That's what we've got there... Do we say quest here? Here's important stuff. It seems it just all all make quite easily for the two different neons. Over here. I did press this, but then I jumped. Excuse me, I'll use that blade of yours. Curse my luck. I branded. No time to haggle with whoever holds your leash. Wait, that's the slumbering chocobo you're wearing. You in the Marfers, are you? Good. She won't begrudge me the use of you then. Not while there's wolves about. We tried dealing with them ourselves. Made out bait, think we might swoop in and slaughter a lot. But we didn't expect the pack to be quite so bloody big. I expect the blight drove them here. Somebody's going to help us out then. Pastures. We'd hoped empty bellies might make them easy prey. We've made them mean instead. Marfers no fool. So she must see something in you. Do us a favor and get rid of him, will you? All right. I suppose those walls pose a threat to everyone. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I'd wager the greedy bastards are still over yonder, finishing off our bait. This is beef to green. You've seen to every last one of them. Go and speak to my friend over the bridge. Bryce, his name is. You want to know if it's safe to come across? Alright, off you go then. I was, I was spoke down to you. <laughs> so I was like, you know, a brandy do uh, just speak down to you. There'd be wolves. Take the wolves out. Stab him, mummy, wolves! Collective, any collectibles are quite good because they just sort of nip straight to you. Right, so we need to go up this way. Go up this way and speak to Bryce. There's no place in the room. Yeah, there's this bit. There's a bridge. It sometimes just takes off for some, some reason. As it did, uh, we're getting close to the red mast. You, Bryce? What's it to you, Bearer? Your friend asked me to get rid of the wolves. So I got rid of the wolves. You'd have me believe a single bearer slew the entire pack. Then again, if you didn't, you wouldn't be on this side of the bridge. Bugger me, you're a tough one, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Frederick! You oily bastard. I never thought to pit beast against beast like that. You served us well, Bearer. Be sure to pass our thanks to your master. There's no master, but... Happy days. Give us a bit of XP. And some stuff. So it's good to even get his stuff. This stuff is handy for 
losing. So what is, what's doing in this view? Um, unless we have to sort of drop down and go underneath the bridge to get there. It's just that there's that wee homey hobo but something over there as well. Let's see if there's any goodies. It's nice when there's goodies. We can then head to East Pole and that. Beasties, but there's a really good age area to get in search. And there's the house. There might be stuff. See it. We've got a goblin coin, which is used for pennies basically. Sell on, get some pennies. Don't there's anything else in here. Any good RPG, Dave, check every corner. Nook and cranny. Some good stuff over there, but uh, there's a wee glowing collectible something over there. Just on the sub. There's a wee boost, isn't there? We've got a Minotaur over there. Yeah, they're, they're, they're a wee bit tough. So we, we just we just steal some stuff. And when you turn the immediate it off. Get him, boy. You don't seem to do too much damage. Thanks for it. You get. I know the Minotaur can do quite a bit of damage. Just sort of screeching around it. You can't go across the water. It's an inability to jump across there. Staggered it. Get a point. Keep your distance, boy. Sick of Togo. Get him. Sick of Togo. You know what to do, boy. He's getting me. No, 
no. Kill the Minotaur, I mean, you get some stuff. There's three hornet hangers or something. Mm -hmm. Seems like collectibles of some description over there. Hey, my, my dodge is just... Sick of Toggle! There, boy! Sick of Toggle! Over here! You know what to do, boy! Get him! You just stagger on my range, dude. Sick! No. There, boy! Over here! Sick of Toggle! You know what to do, boy! I'll tell you what Sideways in there. He even doesn't go sideways. No, one of them is doing two. He's getting hit. Stop getting hit. Stop getting hit. <laughs> Let's head, head up, head up the road we were meant to go in. You're heading up this way. Smaller things are not so bad, these minotaurs are just, they are a bit tougher than you want, want them to be. Cool. It annoys me when you try to pick up a potion area and it's just like, no, we can't pick up the potion because you're full. Nice if we could carry more potions. Look, 
the windmills. That must be Eastfall. It's in some plants. Sick of all of you. Get a boy. Sick of Toggle. Get a boy. You know what to do, boy. Get a boy. Sick of Toggle. Get a Some of the features of it show the, the fact that there's no only heal you when you're in, in a fight. I remember coming here with Lord Murdoch when I was young. His area mm -hmm. seemed a very different place back then. Possibly a shop or a shop or something, a little sidey mission, maybe. You know what we want though. You don't have to worry about it. Yes. Ten hides. I'll go through in there. There's maybe something to fight, but there might be a side mission. Oh, we'll see. Can we get there? The Minotaur is take it out here. I'm sure I pressed dodge and it doesn't dodge. I was like, come on. Must be a sort get a few bits and bobs here, I think. Quiet, isn't it? Yes. You! You're Clive Rossfield! It's me, Hannah, Rodney Murdoch's wife. Lady Hannah. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. The Lord Marquis and Jill, too. It's so good to see you both again. <gasps> it's good to see you, too, Lady Hannah. simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what is mine is yours. We should be delighted. She's gonna give us a lowdown. You have been wandering the world ever since. I can well understand fleeing from those iron blood brutes, but oh, to take to the road at such a tender age. It uh, wasn't easy, but we survived and... And now we're back. It's wonderful to see you safe and well, Lady Hannah. Do you think you will stay here in Eastpool? Rosaleth still enjoys the Mother Crystal's blessing. Does it not? You could always move. This house holds a lot of memories for me. So long as I can live here in peace, here I shall stay. Not that it matters. The capital is closed to civilians, by order of the Duchess. Or should I say, Her Imperial Majesty. 
Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of Sambrec heralded a great many changes here. Yes. Of course. Oh, forgive me. I... I didn't mean to... Oh. Please. There is nothing to forgive. Would my mother not make an exception for you and your husband? Surely she would not refuse the Lord Commander. Oh. You haven't heard, then. Rodney passed away on the night of the fire. He never returned from Phoenix Gate. Clive. My poor child. You look pale. All this traveling must have taken its toll. I insist you rest. We can talk later. Hmm? Rush back. I guess. Are you sure you don't want to sleep inside? I can't. Not after what I did. Lady Hannah said she would prepare a change of clothes for you in the morning. She really has been very kind. Thirteen years of killing. Thirteen years without the faintest glimmer of hope. It was only Joshua that kept me going. I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill his killer. That was the only thing that gave my life any meaning. But if it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, then why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. <laughs> when I fought, Hundreds died. There were so many bodies. So many lives cut short in their prime. That day in Dalmechia, I... I wanted to join them. I wanted it all to end. I couldn't bear it anymore. If living meant being that, better to be just another body. And they're fed, When we looked up she's, at me, she's got Shiva. So it was fire. I said a prayer to Metia, and that prayer was answered. You came back to me. The heavens must have a plan for us. Fire and ice. Have you got a smouldering there, Ben? We should get some rest. Right. Good night, Clive. Sleep well. Does it get a change, change out for it then? And he wakes up. Because he's told, been told he's got a change of clothes. So.
different from the ones that just as one was. Yeah. Perhaps now people will not flee at the sight of me. You look just like Elwyn did when he was your age. How did you come to have some of my father's old clothes? Oh, before Elwyn became Archduke, our families would often summer together. He and Rodney were like brothers. These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. Well, I'm very grateful for them. And sorry for depriving you of your memories. Not at all. It's what your father would have wanted. They suit you well. <laughs> thank you, Lady Hannah. Yes, thank you. You've been most kind. No, I should thank you. It may only have been for a short while. But seeing you again took me back to happier times. Fare you well. My lord and lady. And you, Lady Hannah. If we follow the road to the north, it should take us all the way to Phoenix Gate. Let's go. Right, so. Different items. I need to buy some stuff. I don't know if I can grease it, grease it up. I don't know if there's a, a way of use. So that it gives us the yeah, so we kind of upgrade our, our stuff. We shop you over there, it's just handy. And we've got a wee bit for East Pool, wouldn't it? Maybe just. We go down to it to activate it if we've got active. I don't know if we need to go down to activate it, but we just might as well go down just to make sure it's getting for fast travelling and stuff. I think, I think it's all cold then. We're all good. But there was a wee shoppy. Let's see if there's anything else about it. I wonder if Martha could spare us a few bushels. Any, any hidden treasures and any chests? We don't know about because that's what we're at all. Side missions, I can see anyway. Nice. 
it's a wee house that we've just stayed at and she was given new clothes. And then we will do next to the well here is another another wee box. Crafting materials and stuff. Cool. Yeah, this is just typical sort of Final Fantasy music. Where were you off to then? Or hasn't your master told you? Either way, I expect our humble village and your final destination. I'm salad. Um, see, see what he's got. I think it's all stuff that's less than what we've got anyway. So you have different music. To worry about if, if we've got stuff that's better than what we've got. That should make me a few gill. It's almost like, do you need to keep it? Probably not. Oh, well, you won't say no. Just got like anything else for me? Can't cut a lot of this stuff. I don't want to get rid of too much of it. In case it's useful for crafting. Okay, it's resist some of this. Let's get that. There we go. Put 50 of it. This should make me a few gil. I don't, know, I don't know how much we need because obviously the lower stuff is. For upgrading stuff, you don't want to sell potions that you just bought, Dave. See you then. Bring yourself out of pocket. Right, let's do some head, head up here. Phoenix Gate, basically. You? Those are Elwins. <laughs> By the flames. You're his firstborn. Clive Rosfield. You're mistaken. Oh, you can't fool me, my lord. You're the very image of your father. And that would be true even if you weren't wearing his clothes. The self-same garments Hannah was keeping for you, if I'm not mistaken. She always swore that she would never part with them until the day Elwyn's sons returned. And now that day has come. <laughs> Why, you'll be able to take your bearers back as well. My bearers.
Forgive me, Master Mayor. I was a child when last I came to East Gaul. I didn't recognize you. Oh, I'd be surprised if you recognized anything at all. Much has changed since Rosaria fell to the Empire. Not least for the bearers who once served her noble families. <coughs> when the Iron Blood sacked Rosalith 13 years back, many who lost their masters fled here in search of sanctuary. And never returned. Aye. The plan was to send them home once we'd won back the capital. But then the Imperials arrived. Rosaria became a province of San Brec. The duchy was dissolved, and they no longer had any home to return to. Back in your father's day, any bearer who lost their master became a ward of the duchy. We'd hand them over to the sheriffs, and they'd be assigned a new position. But when we saw how the Empire treated their branded, we knew that wasn't an option. So they've been here ever since. And now you want to give them to me? They're yours by right, Lord Rosfield. Bequeathed you by your late father. And they'd be better off serving you than hiding here. Indeed, many of them used to serve your house and still consider the Rosfields their masters. I'm no one's master. Not anymore. They wouldn't be safe with me. I understand. You'll forgive an old man his fanciful notions. Been daydreaming for too long. But still, I would ask a favor of you. A small mercy. <sighs> if it is within my power. One of the bearers is an elderly fellow who still swears absolute loyalty to Archduke Elwyn. I don't ask that you take him into your service, only that you meet with him. Let him see that Elwyn's son still lives, and that he's as fine a man as his father ever was. It would be my honor. Thank you, my lord. He sits by the well most days, watching the people go about their business. If you could show him your face, I would be most grateful. This is like a Rosage of Sea Quest. Fine a man as my father. You're not so very different, you know. Especially dressed like that. Come on, let's go and meet that bearer. Somewhere over here, unusually. Apparently, we're at the well. He's not here. Well, I can't leave without meeting him. I've let the mayor down once already. It would be cruel to disappoint him again. Right, let's ask around. Someone must have seen him. We've always got to. Search. Find this missing dude. Couple to ask. Good day, milady. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a bearer, an elderly fellow who used to serve the Rosfields. Have you seen him? Ah, that old loon. No. No sign of him today. Funny, he's usually down by the well at this hour, cooking up his fantasy feasts. I'm sorry? Oh, he worked in the kitchens at Rosalith Castle back in the day. Still thinks he's there now. <laughs> You'll often hear the poor fool chatting away to the Archduke. Living in a dream, he is. But better there than here, I suppose. I can't imagine the Viceroy stopping to trade tales with the bearer. Can you? No. Anyway, you'll be round here somewhere. I doubt he has the path to stray too far. Thank you. We'll keep looking. Oh, Mia. You're starting to pop. Mm. the sword.
well now. Unfamiliar faces. What brings you to East Ball, travelers? We're looking for an elderly bearer. You wouldn't happen to have seen him, would you? Ah, you mean the old boy who always waits by the well? Yes, that's him. What, uh, what business do you have with him, if you don't mind me asking? You're not from the capital too, are you? We are, in a way. Well then, it's a pleasure to meet a fellow Rosalithian. I was born and raised down Market Street. I never would have left if Archduke Elwyn had survived the fire. It wasn't the same when the Duchess took over, though. All the beatings, the evictions, the levies going up and up and up, even as the blight took half the harvest. Oh, listen to me, telling you what you already know. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I can't help you with your bearer, either. Though I doubt he'll have gone far. He comes here every day, almost as if he's waiting for something. We'll keep asking around, then. Thank you. Anonimo. Patrick the Chocobo Keeper might know where your bearer is. He's taken the old boy under his wing, so to speak. You should go and have a word with him. He'll be in the stables. Patrick the Chocobo Keeper. Thank you. We will. This could open up different shoppy ears. For making you do all this in my stead. It can't be helped if we're to keep up the pretense. Come on, let's head for the stables. See what Paddy's got to see. see Patrick's spending it in him. Where the bloody hell's he got to? Excuse me, but is something the matter? It's this bearer I've been minding. I take my eyes off him for one minute and he disappears. He's not in his usual spot by the well, nor anywhere else in the village. You must be Patrick. I am, but... moment, guys. And this bearer you're looking for, he's an elderly man who used to work in the Rosalith Castle kitchens, yes? That's the fella. How do you know all this? I've never seen you in Eastpool before. But you seem to know the place better than I do myself. Ah, so that's how it is. Well then, if you're acting under orders of the mayor, you're on about to help me find him. He's been losing what little sense he had left of late, saying the sheriffs are coming to collect him, and that he needs to go back to the castle. I was supposed to watch over him, keep him out of trouble. But if he's walked out on us, there's not a lot I can do. Understood. You keep searching here, we'll look for him outside. Thank you. I'm in your debt. <laughs> Oh, I hope he hasn't wandered into trouble. Let's just concentrate on finding him. someone over there it might be him we should hurry company we can't lead them to the old man they need to die agreed there boy 
Are you all right, my friend? Come on. Let's go home. Your Grace. You came for me. I waited for you so long, but you finally came. I'm not who you think. Clive. <sighs> yes. Pray forgive my long delay. It's nothing, Your Grace. I prayed to the Founder that you would come, and at long last, he answered. Will we be returning to the castle, then? There is still a place for me in the kitchens? No, my friend. We will not be returning to the castle, not yet. I'm on a very important expedition, one which may take some time. You... Wait for me in Eastpool. Until my journey is complete, I will come back for you then. I promise. Of course, Your Grace. For you, I would gladly wait until my dying day. Thank you, both of you. You've been most kind. The memory of serving the late Archduke was as one light in the darkness. And now that light burns a little more brightly. It's nothing but a fantasy, of course. But it's better than the truth of the matter. A damn sight better. The blight is on our doorstep. Our harvests are failing. The people are leaving in droves. If it weren't for Lady Hannah selling half our worldly goods to provide for the few of us who stayed behind, we would long since have starved. We want to keep the bearers safe here, we really do. But unless a miracle happens, we won't be able to spare a crust of bread to share between them soon enough. Is it really that bad? So bad, I even petitioned the Imperial Garrison to take them. But when they found out where they'd come from, they damned near spat in our faces. Ducal dogs, they called them. Enemies of the Empire. I know a man named Sid, who would gladly give a home to any bearer in need of one. Leave this with me. As soon as I return from Phoenix Gate, I'll speak with him. Thank you, my lord. Will you be passing through Eastpool on your way back? I should very much like to speak with you again, if you have the time, regarding the future of the village, and what might be done for Lady Hannah. After all, she's done for us. Yes, of course. I'll be back anon. Fare you well, my lord, my lady. I wish you a safe journey. Not too difficult with these quests, yeah. Just one thing. Just gonna take a
The Deadlands are aptly named. I didn't realize they were this close. No wonder their crops are failing. The light is leaching the ether from the soil. And when the last drop is drained, their fields will turn to this. No plants, no animals, no life. And no monsters. I suppose that's one small mercy. What's this? Another relic of the fallen. Won't be able to use any magic here. Another thing to worry about. As if the absence of ether didn't cause enough problems. Take away the land's life force. And problems are all that's left. I can hardly imagine what this place used to look like before the blight took it. I remember. It was beautiful. Come on, Clive. It's time to discover the truth. It's almost as if time had stood still. I suppose no one had any cause to return here. No. It 
is just as I left it. There we go. Three months in. Something that only most folk in Scotland can get a hold of. Sausage. It gives me. Could I have done this? Could anyone? Do we have some investment getting to do? I don't think we're going in the crater, but that's a big crater, isn't it? What is it, Torgo? He's the only one who can tell me what happened. I have to know. <laughs> Kind of leading us down somewhere, eh? Dude. to be seen. Damn it! He's like a bloody eel. What is this place, anyway? Some sort of shrine? Oh, sorry. You've never been here before. This is the Hall of the Gate. The Gate? It's a relic of the Fallen. Only the Phoenix's dominant can open it. Hence the castle's name. This was where Joshua was supposed to... Yes. He would have stepped through this door the next morning and listened to the words of our ancestors. Would you have gone with him? No. The apodotry is holy ground. None but the dominant may enter. 
I and the other shields would have stood guard here and prayed for my brother's safe return. Where the hell did he go? Perhaps he went inside. He couldn't have. He'd need the power of the Phoenix. Thank you, Joshua. Are you sure about this? Nevermore. You don't know what Chelsea can do, eh? Are you following a destiny of some description? Alright. I know not best then to do it is a stuff based in stream, but done. Another Next. gate. Let's see if this one happens. Even if it is a delicious Scottish Scottish lawn sausage. Is like, like guards or something. And we might have to fight. Jill. Right, we're gonna have to fight this log in, in, in an enclosed area. Stuck in town. I've got a lot of points that I haven't actually added to my character yet. Some more before we can get a chance to. More trouble. Get him! Mm, yeah. Get him, boy! Mm. Oh, you know what to do, boy. Get him, boy! Get him! Sick of toggle! Still function. How can any of this? This must be what the fallen ruins were like before they fell. Hey, it's a lovely leak. I've actually got all the post of points and stuff I need to put in them.
hold it. Wait a second, that's weird. stuff to be this way. Let's keep going, let's keep going, see what's happening. Obviously, there'll be a trial of some description and fight things. I don't think we have a local map, it doesn't seem like... It seems like it's up. I mean, this is the way. <coughs> yeah, it must be the way we have not open on the door. Let's find the hooded man and leave. I've got some stuff. Dave, go with the glowy one, go with the glowy one. Take us in the right direction, general direction. There is some pushing. I 
Stone can They use the, the potion if you have to, but go on the thing. Three balls. What the hell are they? Whatever they are, I don't think they're friendly. Get them! There, boy! You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. Get him. Sick of Toggle. You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. Get him, boy. Get him. There, boy. Over here. Get him. You know what to do. Get him. Little bombs. Typical Final Fantasy. Enemy, little bomb. Get a few potions out, mate. Would Joshua have had to run this gauntlet too? No. At least not that I ever heard about. I imagine the Phoenix would receive a warmer welcome. Here we go again. Where will we end up this time? Surrounded by contraptions hell-bent on murdering us, I expect. Could the hooded man really have taken this path? We won't know until we've followed it all the way to the end. Come on, let's keep looking. He's wanting them, he's wanting them to follow it, that's what it is. He's leading Clive as general direction, in my opinion. Get him, boy. You know what to do, boy. Get him, boy. Sick of Toggle. Take too much damage. Can I have potions here? So I don't know when we've got a stone. Yeah. 
Stay down. There, boy. Sick of Toggle. Pushing, we've got that. We've got a lot of enemies. Just run the health potions. <laughs> getting close. Must be getting closer to the end, really. One high push in it, so because you kind of get them to heal. I think it's only can heal ten certain bits of the bar that you can heal anyway. It seems either on them is or the final section. This is like death arena time. I don't like this. Yeah. We've got a big dude. And we've got any, not very much uh, he's a major guardian. Seems the feeling's mutual. There boy! Sick of Toggle! There, boy! Sick of Toggle! You know what to do, boy! There, boy! Get him! See if we can stagger on me. You know what to do, boy! Get him, boy! Sick of Toggle! It's kind of like... Get him, boy! There, boy! Sick of Toggle! I mean, Dizzy's really rich. You can do your producers and judge. And you get a few hits when he got his left and then Hey, player. You know what to do. Just trying to get a bit of you over there. I'm getting there. I'm trying to get Doomed them. Cool. What are you doing? Inmate two man. Alright, cool. I've got some stuff. Some mission numbers I've had to, had to do with the story, take down this iron, go through a gauntlet essentially. 
Must be a fighting one. It's done. What are these creatures? And why do they keep attacking us? I suspect it's a test, young man. They like They're to me. probably asking themselves the same thing. We're the ones trespassing here. They're just protecting their home. Jill, look. Is that some kind of mural? It's worth a closer look, whatever it is. Let's see what we can pick up. I wonder if we have to. Unless we've got to fight some more stuff, because there's potions and stuff as well. Chest and everything, so we've got a I need to go down there, but I suspect there's obviously some more possible things we need to do. We need to be given potions if there's another fight. It's very much a sort of arena. It just, it just seems like a bit of arena, like it's almost like a sword just in case. It's crashing himself there again. Yeah. Alright then. Sick of Toggle! Get him! Sick of Toggle! Get him! Get a boy. You know what to do, boy. There, boy. Sick of trouble. You know what to do, boy. Over here. Just trying to get away from him. <laughs> Just tag him again. What the hell was that thing? It wasn't like the others. It would seem this place holds even more secrets than we thought. I do. Does it matter which one we go? Two, two separate, separate ways here. More things. Stuff 
pick up. Something need to do. Lights. Well, that did something. Right now, another one we've got to do as well. And here on this side to put a similar vein. I'm doing potions, oh, not too bad. There's similar here, I reckon. Beat up the small creature. Too bad, but um, always still makes me think Ooh, something gonna happen. The boat up with some cushions a bit. What have we here? Another fallen wonder. I only. I found another wonder, but I think you can only go to it once we've actually done this. Well, we can use it once we've completed this one. There's going to be tombs and stuff. Things. Let's see if it's as good or bad. Bridge. It could be, could be good. So Beans. it isn't a dead end after all. Apparently not. All depends if we get some dramatic music or not. We'll determine whether we're going to have to fight something, I suppose. That was some kind of trial. It all seems to lead to this room. And look what's in it. How old do you suppose this is? A thousand years? More? I don't know. I've never seen anything like it before. Who is that in the middle, do you think? Some sort of god. Who's that, Gruda? Saving on the uh, color. You, you, you're him. The second dominant of fire. Who are you?
it! Please! Stop! Joshua chose me to be his shield. He gave me his blessing and asked me to keep him safe. I should have protected him that day. It was my duty. Joshua died. I killed him. And I blamed another for what I did. To spare myself the guilt. I feared the Bai. Accepting it, I would lose what little was left of me. So I ran. From everything. And now? Are you ready to accept the truth? I am. I know it won't be easy, but it's what I must do. So that Joshua's soul can finally rest in peace. to fight him.
defeat, defeat. That's this is the important part. Not too bad. Fight ourselves now. Still, you deny it, even with the truth staring right at you. Come on, Clive, face your fears. I don't know if I can take it and push it down. start from he just keeps respawning mere health it's like oh no more you'd have me learn by example <laughs>
on. Back on one. Together, that it's time to find out who we are once and for all. It's going some magic. I'm not sure how it's done, but I'm just not sure how it's done, but I'm a bit more refreaked. So I'm respawning. Bars, it must do something. These old cut. See what comes up. There may be a dodge one if we're not careful. Right. All day, Final Fantasy tune essentially. So I'm just wondering if it is, is, is you got wee bars, I don't know if it's like power bars or some sort. Let's do something. It's not the world of
Clive. Are you all right? Jill. Isn't it? Yes, no. It's nothing. I'll be fine. No more chasing shadows. The hooded man isn't here. We should go. I don't want me to do any awkward dogs. Clive, are you sure you're all right? Whatever it is, you can tell me. <laughs> I had a hard enough time telling myself. I awakened as a dominant of fire, right here in this castle, and I've been running from it ever since. But now I know for certain who I really am. The second icon of fire, who killed my brother and burned this castle to the ground, was me, Ifrit. Clive. I took so many lives that night and destroyed so many more, including yours. And I must atone for the crimes I've committed, but not before I learn the whole truth. How can a second icon of fire even exist? And why was I chosen as its dominant? Who is the hooded man who brought us here? And what does he want? I need to know. And since I'm still breathing, I might as well make myself useful. We'll find your answers, together. I want to learn the truth, too. There'll be time enough for atonement when we're done. I was hoping you'd say that. I don't think I could do this without you. You never were one to hide from the truth, even when we were young. And you haven't changed a bit. You're wrong. I have changed. But I don't want to be that person anymore. The things she did were unforgivable. And yet, they're what brought us back together. Thank you, Jill. If he is here, then the disturbance I felt at the care must have been confounded. The hour is later than I thought. Just missing his old the Joshua. Delivered. Who, who delivered the coffer said he said Sid paid him. I 
let you run amok with the rest of your rats? And this is how you repay me? <sighs> Find out where he is. I'll crush him, flay him, rip out his heart, him and all his filthy brood. And send every last one of them to out. No. Yes, yes, my lord. Soon, soon, soon. I'm I thought it was Monty Python in meaning of it. Right. So, the Frit is. Thoughts on the issue of Mimi. Right, so pressing then R3 and L, L3 and R3, there's a, a magic feat to attack. So, okay. what next? We return to East Pool. I promise. So, we may kind of just wander down towards East Pool here. It's the mayor I talked to him again about Lady Hannah, amongst other things. Though she may be loath to leave, I can't help thinking she'd be safer with Sid, too. All right. We should arrange an introduction then. So maybe we gain lots of potions of thought we didn't hold anymore. Torgal, what is it? Nothing good, I'll wager. Come on. I just wonder if you, if you know what I'm this bit. There's a I'm guessing some of them do this now or later. Yeah, it's gonna have to be later. As in, I suspect there's a big bugger that we're gonna have to kill. We get to use our um, newfound power. Didn't look good at it, yeah. What happened here? Imperials, you'll pay for this. Oh, we've got a live one. What are you doing here? Remember our orders? No survivors! Who would order such a thing? Sick of Toggle! Boy. 
You know what to do, boy. Thought you could escape us, did you, Branded? You know what you to do, boy. You were born as a boy, and you die one. <laughs> Some big bugger or some. All must burn! The bearers and those who sheltered them. By Empress Annabella's command! My mother was a best. I know. I could wait. Sick of Toggle. Down, he's down, he's down. Too late, Gav. Clive. Acting on the orders of the Duchess, eh? We knew Eastport was harboring bearers. 
Thought they were safe enough hidden up here, but someone must have let slip. If they'd have only come to us sooner, none of this would have had to happen. Fuck! My mother always did despise bearers. The way father embraced them when the other nations spat on them as slaves. The way an accident of birth gave them a power that others lacked. But why kill everyone? They meant no harm. They just wanted to be free. This world judges that a crime punishable by death. Which is why we're going to change it. Gav, we want to help. Thought you'd got your own stuff to be getting on with. We do. But it can wait. In that case, we should head back and tell Sid you've had a change of heart. He was always on it yet to join us. All right. And we'd best be quick. Last I heard, he was planning another excursion. What about the villagers? Oi! Can I leave you's lot to take care of things here? Of course. We'll make sure they get a proper burial. Thank you. All of you. When you're ready, then. Now, rats, lead me to your nest. Lord Kubka has a message for your leader. If only he knew where to send it. <laughs> so obviously got no option but I've got to go, go there but I'm guessing there's somebody who wants to fall and try and take out the the hideaway what up David and that player I can Hey Combustion, how you doing pal? To Sid Sola then. We have a lot to discuss. Let me see what we're doing. I heard Otto barking at his lot earlier. Didn't sound happy. Look what the curl dragged in. If you're going to Enjoying 16. Yeah. I just see well, this is anything. Really easy Come to again. Get out. Oh, don't. Right, she doesn't need to see how many. I don't think we can upgrade this stuff real quick. Cool. Same for you, dear. I, I, I can't upgrade any of the stuff I've got here. That it? Fine. Must be, must be max, maxed out. She seems a joy. She's probably not married. <laughs> Possibly. Possibly. <laughs> I'll ask if she's single. Hey, Karen, are you, are you single? <laughs> hey, it's. Don't mind got... me. Just taking a quick quick. Let's go this way. She said. Still got to keep running. Or we can walk in the door. This place is getting more crowded by the day. I tell myself the bustle's a blessing. There'll be time enough for quiet contemplation when I'm dead. So, did you find the answers you were looking for? 
I still don't know what to make of this gift, curse, or whatever it is I've been given. But there is one thing I can say for certain. Yeah, combustion. I was kind of seeing myself to play Freed. this or to play a bit more. There is nothing I can do to change that. It is a burden I must bear until my dying day. <laughs> Spoken true. Forgiveness and in turn salvation can only begin with acceptance. It's a path we all must walk, no matter how colourful our histories. Sid, you once told me that you wanted to build a place where people could die on their own terms. I did. I've been thinking about that. Why not a place where people can live on their own terms? For 13 years, killing was all I knew. So obsessed with death that I, I need to get doing more Gran Turismo. I started the Mass Effect games again. <laughs> You'd be there forever, combusting. So play the Mass Effects. Because it was on they plus. Bearers or beggars. Most but march blindly to their end. Never realizing that they too deserve a choice. Can you imagine how many uh, episodes you would need to make if you say I dare not turn a blind eye to their suffering any longer. Series. So, be there it's forever. Man, is it? Yeah, I've been doing some racing. That was the answer we found. The only one we need. We got a bit of punting on. Uh, I'll be expecting you both <laughs> to pull away. He certainly would. And we will. I got a bit of a punting on the well, um, elk for here anyway. Early Monday mo planet morning. Mine might just work. Because I went, played Monday and I went into Tuesday late night. What trouble are you looking to get yourself into? And then into I was like, I'm doing okay, doing okay. And the then suddenly this guy decided to ram me off completely off the capital and pay a visit to mother. Just absolutely punted me right off, and I just like, can I be bothered? And I just basically went, no, can't be bothered. Turned it off. Should have continued the race, but because it always harms your DR. But and the last of our farmers, uh, the boy basically he arms is clean. Take me out and Nothing then quit right away. To fill the capital's granaries before winter. I just wish there, there was a way to ban players like that. The black creeps closer as we speak. And yet you do naught but ball and bluster. Your radiance? If it is fertile land the Empire requires, we need but look south. Uh, if you mean the crystalline Dominion's holdings, we are bound by mutual accord. Theirs is a neutral state whose borders we are sworn to respect. Gentlemen, did we swear to see our people starve? Well, I really do think it. The gates of Oriflam buckle at the flood of those come seeking refuge from the blight. If there is not grain enough to feed those within our walls, how, pray tell, will we feed those without? But instead of setting your minds to riddles such as these, you lock horns with an enemy from across the sea. Sending our soldiers to the slaughter in their thousands. The Empire bleeds, and you sit here prattling like crones in a tea house. And you fancy yourselves leaders of men. <laughs> Sandbreck is naught without her citizens. We are but their servants. If Need to bring sectors and staffs back into fashion, lol. <laughs> <laughs> new lands for them. 
Your radiance. You cannot mean a war of conquest. This is a lot of people uh, of course it does. That is exactly what I mean. It is hmm? time we expanded our dominion. This is the will of great Grieger. Everybody's play E D D. They just staff and set those. Shall we raise the furs? Well, someone will have to contend with the damage. I will not keep you. You all have much to do. Hello. As everybody says this is kind of bit like Games of Thronesy. The Lord Prince is currently garrisoned at the Strait of Arthur. If it please you, I can send word requesting his immediate return to the Holy Capital. That won't be necessary. Tell him instead to see to his wounds. Bahamut's strength will be needed again soon. As you command. Let's see what we need to do next. Where are we going next? I must have misheard. You mean to tell me that the Mother Crystals are the reason the world is dying? Are you mad? I have been called that on occasion, but no, not today. We've all seen it firsthand. Empty wastes where once were green meadows. Land drained so dry of its ether, not even the rats remained. But where was it all gone? I spent years searching for an answer until I saw it standing right in front of me. There, in the self-same crystals, we look to for their so-called blessing. All right, listen. Take this crystal. How does it allow us to conjure magics? Answer, by drawing ambient ether from the air. And where do these crystals come from? That's easy. They're mine from the Mother Crystals. They're one and the same. Although, admittedly, this here fits more easily in the pocket. But the Mother Crystals are massive. Some as large as mountains. So you see the problem. Imagine just how much ether can be drawn by something that size. As to where it's all going, mind, well, I can't know everything, can I? We are told that the Mother Crystals are divine. Their ether a gift from the heavens. For centuries, nations have fought and fallen for want of that gift. If what you say is true, how did no one else see it? Who says they didn't? Maybe the truth was inconvenient. Inconvenient to whom, exactly? Hello, hello. Hi, Marley. How you doing, pal? Is he here to come in? The gods themselves. I was, I was debating to do this or Gran Turismo. To do something about the crystals, and what? Well, I'll do this. I thought I'll continue the story here. Bearers and dominance anymore. Hello, Marley. I made a promise, and I intend to keep it. But if we continue down this path, there's only one fate that awaits the realm. And we can't very well set our people free if they're all lying dead in a blighted ditch. Not if we want to create a place where they can live on their own terms anyway. It sort of defeats the purpose. A so, CC hello. If we have to bring the old world crashing down in order to build us a new one. What say you? Are you with me? I think he is. I suppose it's about time I repaid your faith. <laughs> you could have just said I. 
But it's nice to have you aboard all the same. Let me see who we ever go next. Magical creatures are going to find next. To kick up. Still up what have I got myself on. into? I'm going to need more than a few potions for this. Right, I'm going to go do this wee dude as a wee side quest or something as well. Don't mind me. Just take it. To send a message. What is what's happening here? It's all gone. You've lost a letter. Nothing too important, I hope. Not just a letter. I lost everything. There's a hole in my damn pack, and fool that I am, I didn't bloody notice. It can't be that bad. No combustion. How could it be any worse? I'm a courier. I carry things. If I can't do my Bush job, I'm Molly. <laughs> Nothing, that's what. I buggered him right up. That means no herbs for the infirmary, and no fresh meat for our cooking pots. Worst of all, that letter I lost? It was for Sid. A letter he's been waiting on for days. Maybe if you retrace your steps. I'd scour storm from coast to coast if I could, but there are curse breakers in the field, counting on my arrival. No. I'll just have to own up to Otto and Sid. They're gonna skin me alone. Fine. Tell me where to look. Are you serious? Thank you. It sounds like the hideaway could use those supplies. So, where should I start? Gotan's bales, perhaps? I took a tumble in the bushes when I was passing through. There's a chance my pack might have caught on something. If you can find everything I dropped, you'll be doing us all a favor. And if you can find Sid's letter, you'll be saving my life. If it's there, I'll find it. Wonderful. Now, I have to run if I'm to make my next delivery in time. I trust you can find your way to Gotan's bales. Oh, and hurry, will you? Sid doesn't like to be kept waiting. So it's handy sure to do uh, do some side side quests. Always a good thing. The letter won't last very long out in the elements. I should make for Sambrek as soon as I can. Let's, let's, let's head down here and then we'll go to the main mission. I heard Otto barking his lot earlier. He's never this late. Where are you, Randall? Is everything all right? Forgive me, young man. I was in a world of my own. I'm worried about my friend, you see. He left some time ago and hasn't returned. You know what it's like out there for a bear on his own. Why leave the safety of the hideaway? For coin. Sad though it is, our need outweighs the risk. The hideaway can't survive on goodwill alone. And though Karen does what she can, her coffers aren't bottomless. Wait, you were a soldier, were you not? In the Imperial Army? I was. Then I ask a favor of you. I'm too old to be traipsing hither and yon. Will you go and find him for me? I'll do what I can. Oh, thank you. What can you tell me about your friend? His name is Randall, and I suspect you'll find him in Lost Wing. He's been working for Quinton, the tavern keeper. He'll know something, I'm sure. I'll speak to him. Safe travels, my friend. And thank you again. So here we go on the side, side quest. We still get to the show you where we want to go. Let's start off here. Let's 
stuff still over here somewhere. The courier said his pack might have split while he was passing through the bales. I better keep my eyes open. Good. Looks like I'm in the right area. More of the lost supplies. I'm too too far to go at least. Is... Fit much more in his pack. Still no sign of Sid's letter, though. I've come this far. Might as well. A little overdressed to be picking grapes, aren't you? Are you here for Master Quentin? I'm looking for a letter someone dropped nearby. And I suppose you've seen it. Can't say I have, sorry. Well, if you do. Wait, I did pass a dog with something in its mouth a little while back. Could have been a piece of paper. No idea if it was your letter, but you never know. Which way did it go? Towards Lost Wing. Seemed well looked after to me. Dare say someone there's been feeding it. To the village then. Thank you. Sequest. <laughs> it's looking to be a fine harvest this year. It's not too far away. He's got a couple, a couple of little side quests to do. Back are you? Did Master Quint in some? The shad's all salted and smoked, but it'll be an age before it's good. It seems we have our culprit. Sorry, boy. Someone's waiting for this. But he's waited long enough already. Hopefully this will keep our career out of trouble. Yeah, we've got that. We to the other a whole one. day on the line and they're still not dry. Trying to dry off stuff with the magic crystals. What do we do for supper? But how did the grocer know his daughter had been stealing? If it isn't Sid's young protege, to what do I owe the pleasure? I'm looking for a bearer called Randall. I hear he's been coming to you for work. He was expected back at the hideaway some time ago. A friend of his asked me to check on him. Randall, you say? The porter. Yes, yes, I know him. And I can't say I'm surprised if he has been delayed. I gave him enough to do. Though, thinking about it, he should probably have been back by now. I'll go and look for him. Where was he headed? He was to meet an associate of mine to the south of here, on Lorbert's Pass. I do hope nothing's happened to him. Be sure to let me know, Clive. Can I have another cup, Teddy? Uh, how many <laughs> Another tea. Here, here, Dave. What's he got? What can I interest you in today? Got the sailing us. Yes. 
this. It's for Good day. For the lemon break, guys. Quickly, basically. Yeah, I can. You can find this lad for more than right way. Another one. Next step. That's above. Go up the stairs, Dave. Go up the stairs. Let's see, up this way, up this way. Do, 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 do. And this way. Get my bearings connected. find this lad Should do the size quest and hopefully things will do some good stuff in return there's any pieces to kill on the way sprinting like that <coughs> I really like the foliage in this game, really, really nice. These are really important. And if I have to fight something, he's found on me. Gods, you're one of us. We were attacked. Beastmen on the road. Randall knew he didn't play the hero, but <coughs> Reckless Sod insisted on drawing them off. Where did this happen? Further down the road, in the clearing. Please, you have to see that he's safe. I'll do what I can. You go back to Lost Wing and tell Quentin what happened. Carry on. Find some beasties to beast dudes. Goblins. Why am I not surprised? Randall. 
Sorry, Randall. Looks like I was too late. He doesn't deserve to rot by the roadside. I'll speak to Quentin. Done that, we need to go back to the Lost Wing. And then back to the... Lady Clappers here. I like the automatic pushing button. <laughs> Handy. I don't know if you can change what sort of percentage you do on the. It's good and bad to the automatic pushing thing. You don't have to think about it. But you do this. And then I want to go back to the highway. Ah, Have to there be. you are. My man told me what happened. And? I can't help but notice you're alone. Damn it. I feared as much. He's not far from the south gate. I trust you'll do right by him. Of course. I'll send someone right away. I knew he was brave. Though I didn't know he was reckless. Poor fool. Had you known him long? A while. I liked the fact that he didn't shy away from dangerous work. And he liked what I paid. Because it helped keep the hideaway afloat. I'll tell Sid what happened here. I expect he'll be none too pleased to learn of Randall's fate. And I suppose you're none too happy either. For your trouble. Champion and the Sean. Maybe I should just own up to what I would. Well, there you are. I would have stuff just got back to the hideaway, and thankfully Otto hasn't seen me yet. I, I don't suppose you um... found the things you dropped. I did. I was so sure they'd be gone. And the letter. Only a little worse for wear. <sighs> no more skulking about in the shadows for me, then. <laughs> and all thanks to you. Losing those supplies is one thing, but if Sid had found out about that letter... Is it about curse-breaker business? <sighs> if only. It's from his daughter. She's off studying in Canver, and her letters are all that keeps Sid sane while she's away. He never mentioned a daughter. Well, he's a busy man. And thanks to you, he won't be wasting his time smiting careless couriers with leaven boats. So I'd say you did us both a service. Here, for your troubles. If there's anything you're wanting from Sid, today's the day. He'll be sweet as honey once he gets his hands on this. It's always good to do these side quests when you get 
Me topo. Shannon. Não sei, cara, não sei se é o amor, Shannon. Vamos ver o que ela está com. So what God's forsaken corner of the realm is Sid dragging you off to this time? Oriflam. The holy capital. And what business would you lot have in... On second thoughts, I don't want to know. Dangerous stuff. Thing is, we don't need to buy any... The, the swords and stuff. There's always something. It's just... New for the rook. Right. How much have we got? You're rubbing me blind, you know. It'd better all be here. You'll not find a better price than that. Now, obviously, increases does the uh, limit stuff. It has cool down reject. It'd better all be here. Do that. Speaking of Oriflam, are you the trading routes leading south have seen more than double the usual traffic? If you ask me, some at Fowl's Brewing, and it ain't tires bore bile tea. Oh, just go and see Otto, will ya? All right. You see, see the important people. I don't know, he's got something. I see I'm busy here. Well, I ain't the cook, am I? Look. You got anything needs rep. So, what'd it be? Yeah, well, what do we. Alright, we've got an another one. Which is the higher one we've got. Proves something we've got as well. No scratches, all right. Because quite often these purple ones don't do anything to increase the potency of it. That it? <clears throat> Fine. Right, cool. Let's have a look. So we've now we've got another. Then increase the other stuff. So on the hand we've got flame tongue. It's an old uh, it is one that used to pop up quite often in the game. I heard Otto barking at his Final, not earlier. In Final Fantasy one is his old flame tongue. Take a seat, Clive. I'll fetch you a bowl of brown. Uh, it's a wee guy with uh, stuff here. Good day. Or Stuff that's happening and that you can 
What subject shall we consider today? It's got a few things red dots there. Did you learn everything you needed? We can speak to him later. We'll go down to auto, find auto. He's not a pilot. So you're really going through with it? Sid's been talking about bringing down a mother crystal since I've known him. But that's all it's ever been. Talk. He's convinced it's the right thing to do. We'll be leaving for the capital shortly. <sighs> well, you couldn't have picked a better moment. Seems the eye in the Royalists gave him wasn't enough to dampen old Sylvester's spirits. His legions are on the march again. This time, due south. Another war. All as the great Grieger wills it. Bloodthirsty little miss, that one. Well, that's gods for you, innit? Still, might work to our advantage on this occasion. Wars breed chaos. On the front lines, and at home. With a fair wind behind them, a handful of like-minded ne'er-do-wells could melt into the back alleys of Oriflam. No trouble. It's making it to the capital that's the problem. The checkpoint. That's right. Anyone traveling in or out of Oriflam has to go through Northreach. Lucky for you, I might just know of a way. There's... Well, no, not that. That gets you an audience with the Dame. And it's the Dame who'll see you safely through Northreach. I'll send a Stolas in the morning, let her know you're coming. We go way back, and she's a true friend of the cause. I'm sure you'll get on like a house on fire. That's good of you, but who is this Dame, and where will I find her? She's the proud proprietress of Northreach's foremost house of ill repute. The Vale. And she's quite a woman, if you know what I mean. A woman. Right. <laughs> Don't go blinding her with your charm now, lad. I'll be expecting a full report when you get back. If you question what he means by a full report, this chap is a bit, a bit uh, shady. Maybe the boy we need to speak to. He just, he just looked a bit shady. I suppose that's everything. Now to find Gav. Let's speak to him. Oh, you're the new lad, aren't you? Goat at your service. Well, at the hideaway service anyway. Otto's put me in charge of reading through the reports sent in by our allies and picking out any problems that might warrant the attention of the curse breakers. Or any other willing volunteers. And there's no shortage of problems, I can tell you. <laughs> well, maybe I don't have to. I'll warrant a strapping lad like you's got people begging him for help wherever you go. Anyway, if you're ever interested in taking a look over the list, just say the word. Reckon you could probably tick off the odd thing here and there. They say little acts of kindness are their own reward. But if that ain't enough, these have got proper bounties on them and all. Anything catch your eye? It's a busy, basically uh, side, you need side any help, quest. Uh, Miss Molly, I don't know. We, we could rinse and chop these greens for the stew, I suppose. We've got, we've got extra tunes on it too. Well, 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 someone's in a hurry. Just following orders. Funny, I never took you for the type. Can't all be as obedient as you, Gav. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Fine day for a little mischief. 
What did you say? Is this all of us? Actually, Gav won't be coming. Just the three of us, then? Drake's head is the keystone of the Empire. Oriflam's in chaos, yes. But that doesn't mean we can march an army through her gates. The fewer our numbers, the better our chances of going unnoticed. And should that plan fail, well, we have our icons to fall back on. Sid, I... I don't know if I can. Ifrit still seems to... come and go as he pleases. Ordinarily, Prime and Icon comes naturally to a dominance. But then, you are no ordinary dominance. Well, he's still got the blessing of the Phoenix, doesn't he? Not to mention what he sucked out of Garuda. And did I ever tell you about how he was once the greatest shield in Rosaria? You know, I reckon he could probably cause a path out of the capital on his own if need be. Let's try not to find out. We're less likely to be <laughs> spotted if we travel separately. I'll meet you in Northreach in a few days. You two behave now. <laughs> Cheeky wink. What does he mean by that? I'm only mean, leaning back a bit here just because of the. I go for too far forward and the glare from the window just makes me go weird. to go to Lost Wing first. According to this, and there's side quests and stuff. So, we're meeting in Northreach. But will I find Sid and Jill before this dame finds me? Which way are we going? Seems like we're going across there. We must be running up there. That'll be enough. But how did the grocer know his daughter had been stealing up? There's a couple of side quests. I will want to do them, obviously. This seems to be the general direction we want to go. Is it safe to ride to Northridge now? Seems to be the right general direction. We're going to come up and join up this way. A lot of the areas will join, will join up with half of these. And then we've got stuff. Let's make this quick. Leave it now. Is he 
do need to fill everything. Some wild chocobos. A dragon or something. Bring it down, so. Happy days. Yeah, because we've come around this way, so we can see we are enjoying that. I think we could do it. Yeah, really nice. This may be something useful. The soldiers used to speak of a brothel, but that was north of the checkpoint. I hope the dame has friends in the south. It all smells so delightful. You seem to be like going... Oh, and the fish, fish! All from the Sea of Graces! We've red, white... With the right to confiscate any objects. Not another step, Branded. Or you'll be spending the night in a cell. Let me speak to somebody. Are you gonna buy something on? Is a shopping. Welcome, welcome. I do so, like a customer who knows what he wants. 
Now we need it. It's freezing fishery. Where's the... There's a need to... Talk to. Spices from the far away desert. much for this one. It's not only in the zone, it's on this marketplace, I mean, there's an icon here. A moment, my lady. A moment? <laughs> I doubt you could afford even that much of my time. Mistake. No, mine. Upon reflection, you don't have the scent of a branded about you. The flowers. Otto always did know how to please me. More than Sid ever did, anyway. Do you think you could please me, Clive? You're the dame. Let us leave such impersonal titles to my less preferred clientele. You can call me Isabel. Otto assured me I could trust you. I can trust you, can't I? You can trust me, yes, but why would you? Help you? Because that's what we do. Long ago, Sid did me a kindness when no one else would. I have never forgotten that. Without it, I would not be where I am today. And so, I make it a point to do the same whenever possible. Which brings us here. To the final obstacle between you and whatever it is you seek in the holy capital. I fear the guards are not likely to let a masterless bearer pass unmolested, unless... Unless... <laughs> unless, of course, his master deigned to appear. Yeah. That will do nicely, but I shall expect a favor in return. Wait, what? You say these are all from Dalmechia? The fruit's not getting any fresher. What the hell are you doing? Tut tut. We cannot have people thinking I tolerate disobedience from my branded. The men who gave me this are no more my masters than you are. But it's not as if I can hide it. From the moment you acquired it, that brand has done naught but take. But today, it is going to give you exactly what you want. Just play along. Madame, back to the vial already. But of course, we must make ready to welcome you, my dear. And who might this be? Why, my new escort. The streets aren't safe for a girl, what with all the royalists about. <laughs> well, don't work him too hard. 
Well, that rather depends on you now, doesn't it? I'll see you all at sunset. <laughs> Oi, hold up. <sighs> Another fucking branded. Oh, you're lucky you're with the dame. Get out of my sight, filth. That wasn't so bad. Wasn't so bad. They might have recognized me. But they didn't. And even if they had, they wouldn't have done anything about it. The gentlemen of the garrison are some of my best customers. We have an arrangement, as do you and I. Now, if you'd care to follow me, mm. we can speak more at the Vale. Yeah, I suppose it's a kind of... Doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. Not really. I haven't seen you around. And if anyone requests her company, tell them she is feeling unwell. Madame, you look stunning. As do you, my dear. Shall I have one of the girls draw a bath? That won't be necessary. And Clive has got as far as he Clive, can go today guy. before I have to actually Welcome skedaddle off to work. To the so if I don't go now, I think I'm going to struggle. What have we got here? So we can give it a wee save. And we'll find it. Ha well, let's see what happens. See if there's a wee cutscene or not. Let's do something. Thank you for seeing me through the gates. My lady, I am in your debt. Well, that was the whole point, wasn't it? And I told you, it's Isabel. Whatever wound you so tight, I wonder. It's certainly not Sid's influence. You uh, mentioned a favor. What is it you'd have me do? I don't want to keep my companions waiting. If you mean Sid and the girl, you needn't worry. They have yet to reach the checkpoint. Yes, Otto asked me to help them as well. But to answer your question, I need you to find someone for me. One of my girls. Tatienne has been gone for several days now, having left no word of explanation. And I've begun to fear the worst. I feel as if I've spent my whole life searching for people. Though I can't say I'm any good at it. I trust you'll do your best. Oh, and take this. Proof of that trust. And hopefully enough to keep prying eyes from looking too closely at that handsome face of yours. Now, I have matters to attend to at the Iron Flagon. If you find anything, ask for me there. Start here. There's lots, lots of you eh, see side questies. Shoppy. See a lot of the areas are slow in and connecting, which is quite good. So I need to speak to people and do do some side quests and see what happens eventually. Uh, let's call it quits for tonight or for this afternoon. I think uh, we've done quite well for uh, the old uh, Clive here. There we go, let's see that.
can't spark. Do it again another day, another time. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for watching. I know one or two years I've probably left a wee cheeky like or so. Gives a familiar face, faces and names. Right, catch you again later, guys. Bye for now.